Hello, everyone, and welcome back to TechZulu Live at New Media Expo in Las Vegas. I am now joined by Masha and Kelly of the Dot Me Registry. I want a Dot Me. You should get one. Please get one. <laughs> Everybody needs their Dot Me domain with their first name and last name ending in Dot Me. And and why? What is the biggest single most reason why we need dot me domain names? Because it's me, it's so personal, you know? Because we like to think that a dot com is for great for a corporation, but then if you have a personal website or a blog, then dot me is definitely the way to go. It's what? short, it's memorable, it's catchy, it's very, very hard to forget, and you know, no one wants to have a twenty five character URL. No, not at all. And I don't like the dot nets either. I'm kind of like, ah, you get a dot net when you couldn't get a dot com. And then there's the dot co for more of the company stuff. And well, dot me is for me, right? Yeah, exactly. It's for people and for <laughs> online branding. Everybody yeah. needs to be their own personal brand now. So yeah. dot me helps you like put all of your content in one place online where people will know that it's about you yeah. and that it all belongs to you. So like your, your own personal site, your portfolio site, your branded site. You know, Mitch Cantor, who's a web designer, was on TechZulu earlier today and he was talking about the importance of your personal site needs to be that imprint of you. It needs to have your style, your personality. It's about me. Exactly. So is, is that sort of where this came from? Exactly, and especially for bloggers, for up-and-coming bloggers who want to claim you know, their own personal part of the internet, yeah. it is so important to have that kind of platform. Mm -hmm. And we've been in Blog World for quite a few events now, and this yeah. is our third one, and it's so nice to see that more and more people come up to us and are like, oh, we've seen you guys, we have a dot .me, we really love it, <laughs> so we're really hoping that that's the way it's going to go, that yeah. it's only going to grow. How long have the dot .me domains been available? We've been around since 2008, okay. which is, we're, we're young, but we're very fast growing. And a great advantage of that is that chances are the, your, the domain name that you're interested in would be available as opposed mm -hmm. to a dot .com because okay. they've been around forever and so many of the good ones are already taken. Yeah. So, so when there is a new domain like dot .me, it really does make a lot of sense to scoop up as many of them as you can because well, you never know who's going to scream, I want Kelly's glasses dot me. Yeah. <laughs> that would be me. <laughs> no, that would be me. Me, me, me. Amanda Kulong dot me. <laughs> so what is your role, Kelly, with dot me? Um, I do North American business development. So okay. .me is a Montenegrin company, and sure. ME is the country code assigned to Montenegro. And yeah. I apologize if you already went over this and I'm saying it again. Okay. Um, but the team is based in Montenegro, and we do a lot of business in the US. Mm -hmm. So I handle all the stuff that happens here. What kind of questions do you get when people, you know, first hear about dot me? Actually, let's Kelly answer this one. Um, most people sort of want to know what it is in general. A lot of people yeah. aren't familiar with domains yet. And the right. general public sort of is sort of coming to it, you know, a little, oh, I'm not going to bite, really. <laughs> sort of coming to it um, <laughs> a little bit late in, in like the internet's life. Yeah. Um, but it's really exciting to get to tell people, you know, what a domain is and like what the differences are between the different extensions yeah. because they all do mean something. Yeah. But only .me means, you know, personalized for human beings. You know, you just bring up a really good point and I'm sure that Masha, you could attest to this too, being a community person. Um, when you look at the sites where you can purchase a domain, they don't really explain to you what each of them means. That maybe if you know you really want to have a full blown presence across everything, it's important to try and grab the .com as well. But if not, you could go with .co if it's a corporate thing, or if it's just personal for me, it can be a .me. They don't really explain what each of those are for. Do you find that with people that you're speaking with on on the social accounts? Yeah, for us, it's really really easy because we're, we're .me. It's so recognizable that it is for yeah. personal use. And actually, we have a great video out that's starring the comedian TJ Miller. Oh. It's called Corporate Guy. And the slogan is, you know, you're not a corporation, you're a person, get adopt me. So it's Ooh. really, it's, it really rings a bell and it, yeah. it's really easy to associate it with personal use. Right. You're not a corporation, you're a person, get adopt me. That really resonates, yeah, and especially because a lot of us that live in the web world, you know, and, and have been doing a lot of digital stuff, we have different faces, and we don't necessarily want them all together, mashed together. That's why some people actually have problems with Facebook, because it's mashing these different worlds together. Yeah, yeah, we've actually had quite a few people who for their business have a dot .com, but then right. the, for their personal blog have a dot .me, sure. and that's worked out really, really well. Mm -hmm. Now I'm assuming that both of you have dot .me's. 
Yes, we do. Okay. <laughs> yes. So, we do. so we can go look them up. Yes, and we also have our About Me splash pages too. About Me is a great service too. It just yeah. allows you to get, you know, just easily create a splash page and sort of put all of your internet presence together. Yeah. So you, you know, you have your big resolution photo, you have your little bit of your information, and then your social media channels. Yeah. Do you have people signing up here at the show? We do. We're actually giving out free .me domain names today. Oh. So we've had a couple of people. <clears throat> Ahem, Kelly, ahem, ahem, Kelly, ahem. Oh, bring you a couple. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking Sorry. about right now. <laughs> no, 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 we'll, we'll come find you because we need .me, or at least I do. And then I'll make Efren, I'll make John, the whole production team will have .me's by the end of this. <laughs> Is there any other news that you want to share? Um, any, any big announcements coming out of .me or any milestones you want to share? Um, well, we are about to hit our 700,000 domain mark, which wow. for a non-com domain is a really big deal. Yeah. Um, so we're super excited about that, and we've got a big campaign going on all year with college tours, um, college comedy tours, and we've got a ton of promotions coming out, mm -hmm. and we have our fantastic video with TJ Miller and all kinds of great stuff going on. So we'll oh. definitely be letting everyone know what's happening with us in the all coming right. months. And is the video, is, is that video available now? Can people see it now? Now it's on YouTube. So if you just type in corporate guy on YouTube, you will see the amazingness of TJ Miller and that whole production. We're really, really proud of that. It's also on our website at um, www.domain.me. Domain.me. Oh my goodness. You are not a corporation. You are a person. Yeah. Or you can also go to register.me. So many places for me to go. But um bum <laughs> Well, lastly, we're here wrapping up at New Media Expo. Um, what do you guys like about this show particularly? I really, really, really like meeting with the people that I actually work with online. So it's really, really nice to have all the bloggers and everyone that I'm in touch with over Twitter or Facebook right. come up. You know, because it's it's one thing to, to tweet or to comment on Facebook or yeah. to interact with them one way, and it's a completely different feeling to actually see the excitement that they have. You mean they're real? They're we're really we're real? We're not a figment of your imagination? We're not just pixels and zeros and ones? <laughs> yeah, I think that's that's <laughs> what it is. Yeah, but it's it's just it's really nice. It's a really great feeling. They're great, genuine people, and you know they're excited about us. They come and they say hi, and it's a really nice feeling to connect with them that way. Yeah. And what about you, Kelly? Aside from people stalking about your awesome glasses. <laughs> we got to meet a lot of really cool new people, and that was really exciting. We come to Blog World a lot, and um, we love every time we come here. It's an exciting experience. It's a super great conference. But at this show, we met a ton of new people. And yeah. There were a lot of new faces here this time. Yeah, it was great. We met a teenage girl this morning who came up and heard about .me for the first time and got so excited and we gave her a free domain and she was really stoked to go home and register it. And we, that, that's what we do. That's what we get up in the morning. So we were It's like Christmas. Really it's like some holiday. Christmas. Yeah, it was really cool. <laughs> yeah, great. it's the gift of me. The gift of me. We could go on and on about me, 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 me. Yeah. Wow, I could actually do that even with a hoarse voice. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much, ladies, for joining us. And, and I, I like the little added touch here of the yes. dot me sticker on the lapel. They, they're very personalized. So Masha and Kelly of dot me. Make sure you get your dot me account. Thanks, ladies. Thank you.